What is up guys, Jack Frostman here, and today we'll be answering one of the most asked questions I ever get, and that's how do you get animals in creative? Um, and this question is asked a ton of times on every time I'm in a creative world with animals. It's crazy. So here is how you do it, guys. Um, so if you want to get animals in creative, you're going to need to be jailbroken. And what you're going to do is start a world in survival, and you guys will see what I mean in just a second. So... So the reason you have to do it in survival is to actually spawn the animals. And it's kind of confusing, but it works. And it works pretty much 100% of the time. So as you can see, I'm in survival right now. Let's see if we can find some animals just to prove there's some in this world. And look at that skin. That skin looks so nice. Looks so nice. Um, and I think they'll start spawning. I don't know like how often they spawn, but we need to find some. So let's go. Let's go on a quick journey. Let's go on a quick journey. Okay guys, so we have found our first specimens. Over here, see we have a nice baby cow and some bigger cows. How you doing today? You gonna be silent on me? Look at that, he's following your butt. Are these the parents, these must be the parents. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm. I really like your kid, though. What do you have to say? Do you have anything to say to me? Oh, I thank you. Why, thank you. Let's see if we can find some other specimens just atop of this hill. And, well, I don't want to spend too much time doing this, but I think it's really cool. Now, so it looks, it looks like we have our culprits down there, so there's proof that there are animals in this world. So now what we want to do is we want to quit the title and just leave it as that. Now you're going to get need to have these IMCPE edits, <laughs> excuse me, and basically this is just an editor, and it doesn't really work right now, and the source that you need from Cydia will be in the description. You do need to be jailbroken, like I said before, and you just go into world data um, after you click on the world you want, and you switch it to creative. Then you can go back and hit save on the top right, and it says saving completed. Go back to the main menu, you can refresh it if you want, and then go back to Minecraft Pocket Edition, whip open your world, and you should be in creative. And you do die sometimes, which is weird. It's a weird bug, but now I'm flying around and there is animals. As you can see, we have our cow friends right here. How you doing? How you doing? Now I can slay them pretty hardcore, but no, I'm not gonna slay them. I'll give them a flower. I'll give them a flower. Cows like flowers, right? Where are you? Here you go. Here you go, big boy. And I think it, it only works if there's already animals in the world. So, um, yeah, here we have some sheep. How you doing, baby sheep? How you doing, other baby sheep? How you doing, chicken? How you doing, other baby cow? How you doing, cow? As you can see, it, it, this works. It's it, it's simple, and it's it's easy to do, and I think you just have to learn it once, and you'll never have to come back ever again to ask this question. So, as you can see, we have baby sheeps galore, like a ton of baby sheeps, so wow. Um, let's see if we can find some more animals. This was a short episode, this is, no, not episode, excuse me, this was a short video. Yeah, as you can see, sheeps spawning everywhere. I mean, this works. I don't know what to tell you guys, it's this simple. I mean, it's a pretty easy tutorial, <laughs> but everyone asks this. And I don't know if anyone else has actually told people how to do it, but I, I, cur I, f I found this on accident. Here we have more chickens over here. I kind of went, came across this on accident. Oh, baby chicken, what the heck? Oh my goodness, your head is bigger than your body. <laughs> I guess all the babies are, but that one's like two times bigger than your body. Dude, that's messed up, chicken. Yeah, so this is a very watery map. None would like this huge ocean in here. But anyway, guys, I think that's it, guys. I mean, I I would like to drag this on a little longer, but I have no idea what else to show you. Um, It works, that's all I can really say. Um, You guys have seen, you guys have seen it work. And you guys, you know, you guys know what's up. Wait, let me check if they, um, I don't know if they actually do drop anything in creative, though. I'm sorry, but no, this is, this is acting right here. I'm not actually going to kill him, but let's hit him in this udder. Let's hit him in his udder. Excuse me, sir. Don't look at me, I'm going to hit you in the udder. Yep, they do drop, they do drop, um, stuff. So they do drop, you know, anything if you actually want that. But of course you're not going to get it in your inventory. There's no, not like leather or beef in here. But they do drop it for cool looks, so you could make some cool movies or something, if you wanted to. And I'm dragging this on, I'm experimenting in the middle of the episode. Let's see if the sheep will be sheared. Oh, you can't get shears in creative. What a bummer. Might as well have to kill him, I guess. I mean, 
Let's check if these guys drop food. Oh, baby chicken don't drop food anyway. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, let's check the sheep. Yep, you drop wool. And let's check a bigger sheep. Ba boom boom. Yep, you drop wool. Wait, I already killed you. I already killed a sheep. Where's a chicken? Where's the chicken? Whatever, you guys get the point. All, the animals do drop stuff. They're completely working. They're fun to play with. And in creative, you can have them. So it kind of improves your world in a way, aesthetically. So anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you learned something through this. And if you did finally figure out how to do this magical thing, go ahead and drop a like, and maybe even subscribe if you're new to me. So thanks, guys, for watching once again, and I'll talk to you guys later. And as always, stay frosty, my friends. Peace, guys. See ya.